Today is the first sparring session of training camp for these guys. It's going to be the toughest day for them. They are going to be put through the ringer. They're getting put in there with some tough guys, guys with experience, guys who are going to push them to their limits. So this is where they find out if they like getting hit in the face or they don't like getting hit in the face. And if they don't like getting hit in the face, it's going to be a tough 10 weeks for them. Uh, but they're going to do okay. I like these boys. They're, uh, they're already putting in the work. But yeah, some of them have come down today, fair play to them. A couple of them, they've gone a bit missing the last week or so, but uh, we'll find them, don't worry. I was initially doing boxing because um, one of the boys was what got me into it um, from work, Tommy Reese, and then um, a month later this came into fruition. Um, obviously the only comms thing came about, so obviously a lot of controversy between each real estate agent, you know, people taking each other's listings and everyone's always talking about a different agency, so it's, a, it's good to kind of get everyone together, um, get in the ring and smack it out. <laughs> been pretty pretty had a good center of gravity um, I come from a gymnastics background so I was a national level gymnast back in the day um, and then thought I'd just use this to kind of lock in the technique get the power right and then you know, I haven't done boxing before but I've yeah, been been smashing it for the past month so today's the first day of sparring um, the future opponents gonna be there so it'd be good to kind of see everyone's skill level where everyone's at and then um, just lock in and then yeah get ready challenging myself. Pox is a great fighter, but he's getting put in there with six foot five Alex, who actually does work in real estate. I just can't find him another six foot five opponent. So he keeps asking me for a fight, and I'm like, Alex, I'll try and find you a fight. But yeah, he's getting put in there with some Russian mountain. Just... So this would, be, this would be the main event if it was fight night. But yeah, Pops is good, but he's going to get put through uh, a really tough test with this big guy. He's going to have to climb that mountain.
hard to transform my techniques from uh, from uh, wrestling to boxing because the guard of wrestling is very low with your chin down and uh, here you have to keep your chin always on your chest and be focused not to get punched on it so it's a bit hard to transfer but we're gonna do it I think boxers hate uh, to fight south because uh, usually people are right-handed and uh, you, the old boxing school is with right-handed and when the uh, lefty comes it's a bit annoying for them I think. So um, I'm Ben, I'm Joe's brother. Uh, I have boxed before, I'm, a, I'm an amateur boxer, boxed out of Anfield, ABC. Um, so me and my brother are both fighting in September, I'm in the championships and he's doing an only comes fight and I'm well more nervous than my brother because you know, I'm in control of what I'm doing, I'm in control of what he's doing. Yeah, you know, my first spa, uh, never, never stepped in the ring before, first one. Um, Four, four minutes it was in there, felt like a lot longer. Um, I said to him as it came out, my legs are really in. I went on a run yesterday and I thought, you know, training twice a day these days for this. So, when I'm on a run yesterday and I feel it today in my legs, like so, I think, um, but I think I've done well. I think showed showed a little bit of, you know, what I can do. Um, but I think there's, there's still a long way to go. Um, it did feel a lot different <laughs> to doing the classes and doing the stuff with Shane and Joe. Um, yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot different. It's, I feel like I felt a little bit of nerves, like watching the other lads, and then when I got when I got called over, it was almost like jogging in. So I was just sort of just went out my system, the nerves, and yeah, when I got in there, I think everyone sort of got a plan. Everyone's got combinations that they're, they're gonna throw, and then when you get in there, it's totally different. about Josh, come on. So everyone knows Josh is absolutely shredded. So um, he's definitely got the, the fitness, he's got the power that's needed. Um, he just needs to focus on tidying up a little bit, being a bit more elegant when he boxes and uh, just dancing about the ring a bit more. I've been friends with Josh for about two years now, uh, since he moved here. Um, he's previously at House and House, now he's at Espace. Both started boxing at a similar time, uh, at the start of the year. Both really want to win from the fights, and I think if one of them loses, one of them wins, it's going to be massive drag and wines for years to come. Yeah, Just finished sparring session, off to go get a suit tailored eight for lighting, and yeah, that's about it. Adam. Afternoon, Steve. How are you? I'm very you well, are? thank you. How are you, mate? Good, good, good. How's training on? Yeah, it was good. It was good. Tough one this day. Uh, it was just sparring. Yeah. Uh, had a couple of sparring sessions. One geezer was just yeah, on form. I was going to say, I must have taken one of his listings, yeah. but um, <laughs> no, nah, it was good he fun. He doesn't like it now. Yeah, something yeah. like that. But don't worry, I'll get him in the eighth. Yeah. So, we'll take you in here now for the, uh, for the fitting. Sure. Uh, so, we want to just take a seat. Appreciate it. So, um, this morning woke up, rolled out of bed, um, just went straight to sparring. Um, had a few sessions of sparring. It was my first sparring session, so it was good to get some rounds in. There was a couple of boys there that were sparring. A couple of them, I don't know. There's not many people in like my weight bracket. I don't think I'm not seeing everyone who's been announced yet. Like, I can tell you for free, uh, bodybuilding training is not the same as boxing training. <laughs> Um, I found out the hard way today. You know what, credit where credit's due, this has actually been a very enjoyable experience. Thank you so much. It's perfect. Not a bonus. I appreciate you not measuring my height on the camera <laughs> as well. We'll keep that on the uh, right. Yeah, <laughs> I have it in my head. <coughs> my name is Stephen Conroy. I'm the made to measure specialist here at 8 Lining in Business Bay. Uh, we offer fully made to measure custom bespoke suits. Um, we've been in business for about two years. You know, I feel like even just having a, a well fitted, well tailored suit, um, whether it be from 8 Lining, it's that they have a, a good well-fitted suit um, that they can stand out and feel comfortable and feel confident in. Some people f have to wear a suit and, and they don't like to wear a suit, but if it's fitted well and it's comfortable, then, you know, then you're going to be uh, standing out a lot you know, and feeling better about yourself. 
sparring today was great, honestly. Um, we saw people really, really, really trying their hardest. At the end of the day, they've got a lot on the line. They're representing their companies, right? What I love most about it is the people that are there, that are their potential opponents. You know, so everyone's eyeing each other up already around the different weight classes and you know the, the, the friendly banter that we anticipated this to be. We knew it was going to be competitive, but we also want to see the guys, you know, interacting with each other in, in judging their opponents, you know. So we saw today, uh, we saw Big Popper get in from Provident Real Estate. He was finding a guy from Luxhaven, which the matchup was just insane. It was incredible. Both the guys in there. You know, neither wanted to wear head guards. There was blood flying. It was it was a real good knock, and it's really setting the standard high for what this ten week training camp is going to look like. You know, so we're learning every day, the same as these guys are learning. So there's obviously going to be nerves. We're nervous, right? We we don't know what to expect, um, but neither of these guys. So there's going to be nerves flying, but I think most importantly, it's more about the excitement that these fighters are getting. You know, the message that we're getting from these fighters, you know, they're wanting to see these vlogs. They're wanting to see the skills that we're getting. They want, they want to know who they're fighting. I know I said this in the last video, they want to know. They're so eager to find out of who they're going to be faced against. Um, so a bit of nerves, a bit of excitement, fear. I don't think any of these guys are the scared type. To sign up to this show, to sign up to what we're doing is a big deal. So I think these guys aren't feared. They're not scared. But I think there's going to be nerves on the day, of course.